Golden Rose and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a day in the life or an updated day in the life since I have started grad school and my schedule has kind of changed. So this is just a glimpse into my day in the life working from home. It's almost the one year, I guess, anniversary since I started working from home. Again, I do go into the office a couple times. Um, but really majority of my time is spent at home. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. This is just a reminder to give this video a thumbs up and comment down below if you're still working from home, if you have worked from home or kind of what your work schedule is like. And also comment down below what field of engineering you're in um, and happy engineers week. So my morning started off with a few meetings. I have a specific notebook that I take my notes in. For each of my meetings, it allows me to track any actions and just take some notes. I always date my paper and include the title of the meeting. And of course, if you haven't noticed by now, I love my coffee. I start every morning with my coffee. So if you're sitting here thinking, well, she's working from a laptop and I can't see anything, um, I am right now I'm working on a big presentation. And so um, a lot of the stuff that I do for work, I can't show you guys on here, but I do love what I do and I feel like every day I make a difference and it is pretty cool to see some of the stuff I do on the news or read articles about it. So um, I, I don't need to show you guys in order for <laughs> it to be important. But I just want to, you know, maintain that privacy and I have to for my work. So I hope you guys understand. I am a mechanical engineer working in the defense industry. So um, I like to make the joke that the things I work with go boom. So I hope you guys kind of understand that. If you're familiar with the defense industry, then you guys totally get it. So I really enjoy my work. I like what I do and I am very blessed to be able to, you know, do majority of what I do for work at home and then go into the office, um, you know, whenever possible right now with the restrictions, we're just trying to keep everyone safe. So ensuring that, you know, we go, um, into the office and wear our mask and we have to go through this whole check-in process, um, just to ensure that everyone's safe. So when we go in the office, it, we have to have a, you know, a good reason to. So it's around 12.30. I have been working all morning. So far I've had like some coffee and water, but I'm gonna go ahead and make myself some lunch. Um, I like to give myself like a 30 minute break, you know, really like just kind of take a step back away from work. Um, I have been kind of just focused on a few tasks and had a few meetings this morning. So um, this is a nice way that I can just kind of take a step away from work. Um, still working from home, I don't wanna like I don't know. I still want to have a good work-life balance and there are some things that I have to get done, but again, I have to take my personal time, have my kind of breaks here and there. I'm going to just take a little 30 minute break, make some food, watch some YouTube, and just kind of take a step away from my desk for a little bit. And um, yeah, so I'll check in with you guys when I am back at work. <laughs> so I just finished eating and I'm going to get back to work. I have um, a few things that I have to get done today, but I'm just gonna continue doing a time lapse to kind of show you guys. I have a meeting in about an hour. Um, and then after that, let me think, what else? After that, I'm just gonna keep working until Darian gets home. So yeah, I'm just gonna do another time lapse and hopefully you guys enjoy it. <laughs> so throughout the day, I will use um, you know various software right now our push is towards one area of a project, so I am helping out with that. That's just kind of reviewing some documents and helping out the team in that aspect. And then, I, like I mentioned earlier, I am working on a really big presentation um, that I will hopefully be giving um, in the early March timeframe. So that's been my focus um, recently, and so when you see me at my computer, a lot of the stuff is either having, I'm having meetings or a lot of emails are going back and forth, or I have like a group chat with our team. So that's kind of been my focus right now. So it's a little after three o'clock and I'm done with my meetings for today. I have a few tasks I still want to get done, but I am a little hungry. So I'm going to make some more food. I'm going to make like a, let me think, what am I going to make? I'm going to make um, basically like lunch food. So that's what I'm going to have with some water and I'm gonna get back to working. So just a quick little meal and then I'm not really gonna give myself a break, but um, I'm just gonna do that and then get back to work and eat while I work. <laughs> 
also just making a quick snack before I head back to work. So in terms of my presentation, I wanted to talk about this a little bit more. Right now I am using a PowerPoint, so Microsoft PowerPoint, and I have a template that I kind of follow and I want to include all of the like project information. I'm including a lot of, you know, information that has been updated recently. So I'm gathering all of that. And then another step that I'm taking is sending out my presentation to get reviewed by some of my coworkers. So it is a little after six o'clock now and Darian is home and we are gonna go hit the gym. There's usually a line, but they are you know, being COVID safe and everything. So um, that is where we're going. So I will show you the line when we get there. So the line ended up taking around 40 minutes and then I started my workout with some cardio on the Stairmaster and it was leg day. So here's a little clip of me doing deadlifts. So it is like almost 9.30, um, I look a hot mess, but I'm about to shower and then um, have a little something for dinner and then head to bed, um, got a good workout in. And so um, tomorrow we're gonna hit the gym in the morning just because usually that's what we like to do. We like to go, um, gym opens at 5 a.m. So we like to be there a little before that and then get our workout in, come home get ready for work and all that. So um, I will catch you guys up tomorrow. I'm going to shower and end my Monday kind of routine. Um, but yeah, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Good morning, friends. It's around 5.30 a.m. right now. Um, we tried to get into the gym but because they are limiting the capacity, we didn't get in. So um, we came back home and I decided just to start work early. Normally, if we go to the gym, um, kind of like I mentioned, I think yesterday, I'll normally start around like 6.37, just depends on when we get home and when I get ready. Um, so today I'm just starting a little earlier. I do have class at one, so even though I'm starting earlier, it doesn't really mean that my day is gonna end earlier. Um, the cool thing with where I work is that we just work whatever hours we can during our time. Obviously, you want to make sure you're making your meetings and attending all the necessary like commitments that you have to. Um, but as long as we reach our 80 hours at the end of two weeks, then we're pretty much good. So um, I mentioned in my last day in the life that they do um, at my work, we do kind of like a flex schedule. So you flex your schedule and you get every other Friday off, basically is what I mean. So I'm not doing that right now because of grad school. So um, I'm just kind of have different hours each day, but I am working like every Friday. So, which is fine with me. I get I have class, so I have other things going on. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and start my day and um, yeah, we'll take you through a regular Tuesday with me. I am hoping that my class will end early so that I can go to the gym still um, because I do um, tutor tonight. So we'll see though. Just kind of, usually my Tuesday class ends early, so I am hopeful. <laughs> so the perk about waking up early and starting my day early is that I don't have any meetings at this time. So I also thought it was pretty cool that with this time lapse, you can kind of see the sun rising or at least the sunlight coming in from the morning. I was able to catch up on some emails and get ahead of some work before, you know, the rest of the team started. And then of course, make my coffee and get some love from Darian and then back to work. So again, today I did have a couple meetings and then I just continued to work on my task. It's interesting watching this back because I feel like I definitely sit a lot and I want to make an effort to not sit as much. So that's going to be my, you know, mental note to myself. <laughs> so it's around nine o'clock now. I am a little hungry. So I think because um, normally I wait a little longer until I eat, but I'm pretty hungry this morning. So I'm just going to make some breakfast real quick and then get back to work. So my schedule on Tuesdays is 
a little different because I have class in the afternoon. So I have class at 1 p.m. on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So it's typically like Monday, Wednesday, Friday are my longer work days. And then Tuesday, Thursday, I do shorter um, kind of intervals between work. So I'll work in the morning and then I'll have school in the afternoon. So it goes from 1 p.m. to 4 p.m. But sometimes my Tuesday class will end early. So I'm hoping my Tuesday class will end early so that I can go to the gym and run some errands and then I tutor um, at 7 p.m. tonight. So that's kind of what my day is looking like. So I'm just gonna continue bringing you guys along. Um, it's definitely different than my first day in my life just because I am you know, in school now doing my master's program. So, um, but it's not too bad. I like having the, the kind of afternoons and then spreading out my time throughout um, Monday, Wednesday, Friday and then shorter times Tuesday, Thursday. So. I'm gonna make breakfast and then I get back to work. So I guess this is more like two days in my life rather than a day in my life because of my weird schedule right now with school. Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, like I mentioned, are my longer work days. And then I have Tuesdays and Thursdays where I have class. And so I obviously, I don't have enough time in the day to work a full day. Um, so what I do is I work a little over half a day on Tuesdays and Thursdays just to ensure that, you know, I do work those days and then I go straight into class. So I am going to make some food right now. I've just been working. I needed to use my phone, so I haven't been recording, but it's around, um, let me see. It's like around 12 o'clock and I have class in an hour and I am pretty hungry, so I'm just gonna make something real quick. And then um, I have another meeting, so I'm gonna go deal with that and just notice there's something on my eye. Okay, so just something really quick and then um, I'm gonna go to class, sign into class, <laughs> go to class, whatever. Um, and then yeah, so I'm gonna cook and then go back to work. So I am back working right before class. I did make a matcha latte with almond milk. So I needed that little extra kick of, you know, afternoon caffeine to get me through the rest of the day. And now it's time for class. So sometimes this professor logs in a couple minutes late because she's also, you know, working and stuff. So I was just waiting. <laughs> and then one of my coworkers called me to talk about something, but we made it a quick conversation so that I could start class. No, I'm just waiting. <laughs> class is starting. <laughs> and of course, you know, I'm going to be taking notes. I structure my class notes the same way I do my work notes. And it's always good to, you know, obviously take notes during class just in case you want to look back on them for a test or a quiz or just for yourself. It is, ooh, my hair. It is a great day when class ends early. So it's 2.15, so I was really only in class for like an hour, 15 minutes. Um, I took my notes. I made some um, notes in terms of like when my homework is due. Um, the cool thing is that both my professors um, have like assignments and quizzes due um, the same day every week. So one class is on Sundays, the other class is on Tuesdays. So I'm gonna have time to go hit the gym, run some errands, and um, I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later. I, um, I'm gonna go change, I'm gonna go run some errands, and then I'm gonna hit the gym. Fingers crossed that there's not a crazy line. I don't tutor until 7 p.m., so I do have a good chunk of time. Um, so I'm excited, okay. I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later. I guess I really love doing a peace sign, but I did get to the gym. I did cardio and back and buys, and then right after I had tutoring, so I went home, showered, and got on Zoom. So it is 9.15 and I just got done tutoring. It was a longer session because I ended up with two clients and they had a lot of work because they have tests and quizzes this week. So um, I am ready for bed. I'm, I'm hungry, but it is late and I wanna wake up early. But this is kind of what my life is like and juggling work, school, and additional work and my life, all that. But um, I was able to run my errands. I hit the gym, as you saw earlier. And then I came home, I kind of cleaned up, I made some food, um, but I didn't eat. And then I, um, cause I like prepped some lunch and um, 
yeah, so my days over my hair is a mess, but, um, yeah, I hope I'm just gonna, I guess, end the vlog here and my day in the life or an updated day in the life here. And, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If, um, if you haven't already, this is just a reminder to give the video a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below, um, where you're working, if you're still working from home or what your kind of day in the life is like, um, regardless of what your career is or if you're in school or any of that. So, um, and then again, if you really, really like the video, go ahead and hit the notification bell. And again, I just thank you guys for all of your support and I hope you enjoy the video. So I'll see you guys next week.